Hello, welcome to this video. My name is Art Proven, and in this video I want to show you why to use macros or plugins. The main reason why we want to use macros or plugins is to run a bunch of MA comments together. That's called automatization. If we create a macro, we can assign it to be launched by an executor or a queue. A plugin, however, can only be executed from the plugins pool or from a macro. Plugins become useful if we need more complex operations. If you need mathematical operations, macros only can add things. Plugins also allow us to manipulate text. By cutting and pasting parts of text, we can compose the comments that we want to send to the MA. Some operations only should be executed if a special condition is met. This can be done in macros, but in plugins you can do this in a much more sophisticated way. Many operations we want to automate because we have to repeat them a lot of times. In plugins, we can create a loop repeating a set of operations. When operations get more complicated, we can divide them in sub-operations, small blocks of code that perform a specific task. However, one of the most important advantages of using plugins is that you have access to all the show data, like queues, effects, or patch. Using plugins, we even can access and edit all the stored files, so that we will have a complete control our show. Last but not least is the option to use a professional editor to create our plugins. How to take advantage of plugins and write your own? I'll teach you in the initiation to Lua course that will start the 17th of January on artandtechacademy.com. 